då vill jag önska er hjärtligt välkomna till Årebageri och kaffe och kommissionär. The environment and the fight against climate change, the transition to a low carbon, low input economy uh, will give us the opportunity, is an opportunity to uh, tackle the economic crisis as well to create more incentives for investment, for uh, innovation, and for the creation of new green jobs. Never before we were even close to what we are doing now. We, uh, we have targets which are the highest, the most ambitious in the world. No other country, no other region comes close to us. Håkan Borg, läkare och båtkonstruktör för Nyköping. Jag har ett, en fråga och det är angående vindkraftens skadliga inverkan på fågellivet. We have to look carefully, make good assessments and then to go ahead with this absolutely necessary source of uh, alternative uh, energy. How green are you, Mr. Dimas? That's the question. Okay, I try to be to to do what I said previously, practice what I preach. Okay. And I'll give you an example. Uh, when I entered the commission as commissioner for the environment, I inherited from the pre previous commissioner a very big Mercedes 500 or something like that, really big car, emitting a lot of carbon dioxide. So I said, okay, if I go to the commission every morning and coming out of this car, I shall not feel well because this emits a lot of carbon dioxide and I'm telling people to buy cars which are uh, energy efficient and do not emit a lot of carbon dioxide. So I, I asked, so I shall not, because I wasn't really a great expert about cars, I asked WWF, they told them, could you please recommend me a car which will be efficient and will not uh, emit uh, carbon dioxide, uh, so they had a project uh, for the 10 top uh, cars, which was uh, uh, supported scientifically by the Hamburg Environment Institute, and they recommended, recommended me a car. Actually, they recommended three. I got the number one, which was the one emitting less uh, carbon dioxide. So I have this car, and I'm very pleased with it. I strongly believe that common sense will prevail in the world, in the world leaders, and that we shall have an ambitious agreement in Copenhagen, because this uh, is absolutely necessary for the preservation of humanity, of our planet.